Hey, good morning everybody. My name is Bill. I'm with notarycoach.com and uh, it's the end of the month. Ended up having 12 signings yesterday. I've got another 10 on the books today. So it's a little crazy, but this morning I'm just feeling so grateful for the relationships that I have with these clients, you know, the, the escrow officers that give me their signing business. I talk about it a lot in my videos and in the email um, information that I send out a lot. Uh, this business is based on relationships and I'm so grateful for the ones that I have. You know, I really enjoy working with the people that I do and I think they enjoy working with me too. Uh, all evidence points that direction uh, right now. So. I was thinking, and I've actually written an article on LinkedIn about this as well, about what it takes to build these types of relationships because they don't just come natural for everybody and you actually have to work on them. You know, you have to have that commitment to a win-win. It has to be good for both sides. And not everybody buys into that philosophy. So you can find yourself sometimes taking advantage of, or maybe sometimes you're the one that's ending up taking advantage of other people. You know, I think there's a key, a key ingredient to success is to be aware of how you're showing up and the impact that you have on other people. But when it comes to the building these types of relationships, what I found is there's like three key factors that really attribute uh, to success as a mobile notary and signing agent for the mortgage industry. Number one is you have to be uh, competent at what you do. Meaning you have to understand your job, what it is that you do, and you have to be able to do it correctly. And I think this is uh, one area that uh, some new notaries don't spend enough time on. And I see it every day, you know, everybody's so excited to jump in and just get the business going and start making some money that they forget that phase three, which is what I call the, the phase where you uh, learn all the documents, processes, and etiquette of a signing. You know, they just want to skip right through that. That is a huge element in building your relationship. So if I had one piece of advice for you, if you're just starting out, spend some time on phase three. Learn the documents. If you're part of the Sign and Thrive course, I actually give you scripts for uh, how to give a brief overview of each individual document. The script works great. It really helps with smooth and efficient signings. But even if you don't join us at the Sign and Thrive course, you know, get some training somewhere, whether it's from a mentor or a uh, different online course that's offered or even a live course, you know, whatever works for you. Get that training, spend some time on it and do repetition. Repetition is key. You know, the reason that these are so smooth and efficient for me is I've done thousands of signings. Uh, so if you can find a practice buddy and practice those signings, your competency level is going to go up. Now, the other huge factor, uh, the other pillar of these relationships, let's call them, uh, is your integrity. Integrity is multifaceted, so there's a lot involved with that, but it, your integrity needs to be impeccable. That's hard to teach, but having integrity means doing what you say you're going to do. So if you're, that means showing up on time, if you're scheduled at two o'clock, showing up at two o'clock or communicating otherwise. Uh, it's also making things right when things go wrong. Uh, and it's also having an understanding of what you're legally allowed to do and what you're legally not. You gotta know what your boundaries are in order to stay within them. And that's totally on you. It's your responsibility as the mobile notary and signing agent. And then the third pillar is your likability factor. These escrow officers have one of the most stressful jobs in the country. So they need to enjoy working with you, meaning that you are an extension of themselves and their services and their personality, and they need to be able to count on you and maybe even have a little bit of fun when you walk in the office and just enjoy being around you. Uh, it's a really hard thing to, to tap into and get to, and you cannot get to likability without having integrity and without having competency in what you can do. Nobody's gonna let you in their inner circle or let their guard down at all if you haven't proven, proven that you can do the job well and that you have integrity and you're trustworthy. So keep those things in mind as you're starting out your mobile notary and signing business. This is Bill with notarycoach.com. I would love it if you joined us in the Sign and Thrive course. You can learn more on that at training.notarycoach.com. 
uh, if nothing else, sign up for their free report so I can give you uh, the free report on how I built my business. Plus, it'll enroll you in some emails that where I give even more information about how to build this business up. Thank you so much. This is Bill with NotaryCoach.com.